Hi, Mary here with Reviewer's Diary. I have a first impression and sort of a review. I've only used this product one time, but I didn't get a good result. It is the Oribe Surf Comer Tussled Texture Mousse. Now, this came in my Sample Society box. This is a really generous size uh, sample. Um, and it says what it is. A whole bunch of stuff, key ingredients, blah, 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 blah. How it feels and smells. It says airy and light. It wasn't. Um, signature citrus and jasmine scent. Yes, it did actually um, have a nice scent to it. Um, it says, it's also sticky enough that we needed to rinse our hands afterward. So does that sound airy and light? <laughs> anyway, this is um, from this um, sample society box for August. And this is a really good size sample. And the full size is, it is $21.50 for the purse size, which is 2.2 ounces. Oh, this is the purse size. So this is $21.50, $21.50 worth of this hair product. Um, the price for a full size, which is 5.7 ounces, is $37. Now, admittedly, this is a first impression, but it wasn't a good one. Now... It was good at first because, you know, it came out very nice, like a regular mousse in my hand. When I rubbed it together, it got like this feel like a gel. And when I smoothed it through my hair, it was like a combo gel um, mousse feeling. Then I went off to work and my hair got bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. Um, I got home and my hair was sticking out all over the place and it just was like too wild for to feel comfortable so I had to correct the problem um, so how did I correct it I sprayed with this Beach Babe texturizing salt sea spray generously all over kind of patted it down a little bit and then I used I really don't like this hairspray, but I'm going to use it up anyway. It's the Garnier Fructus Style Hairspray. I'm really not wild about this hairspray. It has a really weird scent to it, and I really don't like it. Um, but, you know, i got to save money somewhere, so I'm going to use it up. It does work. You can see it is holding my hair in place. Um, you can see... This part of my hair here was sticking straight out to here. Um, so I did have to use quite a bit of this um, and scrunch and shape my hair a little bit so that this would not be standing up on end quite as much as it was. So I don't think I like this. However, I did the put the stuff in your hair and go off and let it air dry thing, which most of the products that I truly love, like Carol's Daughter, they dry nicely in your hair, um, controlled. This actually didn't. Um, it has a regular nozzle on it. Um, it's very full, you can feel it. So I think I am going to try this um, with blow drying, which I don't tend to do with my hair, but it might actually make a difference. So next time um, I'll give a final review. This is first impression review um, of this Oreb um, product. Unfortunately, right now this is a loser. I know this is a good product. I know this is $21.50 worth of product right here, but this Oreb um, left my hair frizzy and a mess. So, so I will re I'll post another review when I use this with the blow dryer. I'll try that this weekend because if it gets out of control when I blow it dry, then we'll know that it's probably not a good thing for me to use. 
So that's it from uh, Mary from Reviewer's Diary with the first impression review of Oribe Surfcomber Mousse, which is really kind of like a mousse gel kind of thing. And that's it. Thank you for watching and have a beautiful evening.